With three weekends remaining in the NFL's 2020 regular season, four of the 14 postseason positions have been filled. Five more could be taken by the time Week 15 ends. But that also means some teams will be scrambling for their playoff lives in Week 15, teams such as the New England Patriots. That's right, a franchise that's played in the postseason for 11 years in row and won six Super Bowls in the previous 19 seasons under coach Bill Belichick will be eliminated from playoff contention if it doesn't beat the Miami Dolphins on Sunday. I think when you think of the Patriots, you think of dominance, Dolphins quarterback Tua Tungavailoa said on Wednesday. They've been very dominant over the past two decades, I would say, especially when quarterback Tom Brady was there. I think they have a really talented quarterback in Cam Newton and also with Jarrett Stidham. Their defense has always been their biggest deal. Belichick takes pride, and all their defensive coordinators that have come there, even Coach Flo, they all take pride in their defense and what they do to stop offenses. That appears especially true against rookie quarterbacks like Tungavailoa. During his tenure with New England, Belichick has compiled a 21-5 record against rookie quarterbacks. In games when the rookie QB is facing New England for the first time, the Patriots have run off 11 victories since the Seattle Seahawks scored a 24-23 win with Russell Wilson in 2012, including a 45-0 victory over Justin Herbert and the Los Angeles Chargers on December 6. I don't think there's any way he's seen everything he's likely to see, said Brian Flores, who came to Miami from Belichick's staff, about what Tungavailoa would face on Sunday. He's so young in his career. Look, it's going to be a very big challenge, not only for Tua but our entire offense and our entire team. It's a good football team. They're obviously well coached. They're tough, they're physical, really, in all three phases. They play team football. It will be a tough test for everyone on our team. New England defeated Miami 21-11 on September 13, the first Sunday of the regular season. Ryan Fitzpatrick played quarterback for the Dolphins, who won one of their first four games but now have an 8-5 record. Miami has a 4-2 record since Tungavailoa became the starting quarterback. Belichick said the former Alabama All-American isn't playing like a rookie. A pretty experienced quarterback in terms of the passing game and what they did at Alabama, Belichick said on Tuesday. He gets rid of the ball very quickly. Doesn't hold it much. Sees coverage as well taking good care of the ball, hasn't thrown the ball to the defense, sees what he's got, understands the pressure, understands the timing of the routes and gets the ball out quickly. He has enough quickness in the pocket to make it difficult for the pass rush to get to him. He can run a little bit, but he's more of a quicker guy in the pocket that's elusive and really wants to throw more than he wants to run. Again, he can run, but he's a good passer and wants to get the ball out quickly in the passing game. Does a pretty good job with that. Tungavailoa said he thinks he's pretty familiar with New England. I grew up watching the Patriots play in a lot of the Super Bowls, Tungavailoa said. I would also say I've seen Bill a good amount at Alabama. You know him and Alabama coach Nick Saban are pretty good friends, so I would say very similar in a way with coach Saban with how they go about doing things. But I know that there's going to be a lot of challenges that his defense has to offer our offense. We just got to be prepared this week for those.